Hey everybody, Christopher Beast here, and in today's video I'm going to be covering the new official Bohemia mod for Armor of Forger, Excavate. To summarize, this mod was made by Bohemia to sew off the limits of what the Fusion Engine can do gameplay-wise and modding-wise, so this game has gameplay that is quite literally nothing like normal Reforger. Instead of a tactical military shooter, this mod is practically Minesweeper. So let's get right into this. This new mod is very similar to Minesweeper in that you will have to clear a board by using numbered hints to tell you how many artifacts or obstructions lay in the circle surrounding the number. However, there are some notable differences from Minesweeper. First of all, messing up in this mode is not an instant game over, and said it will just subtract from your score, and only in the event of your score hitting zero will you get a game over, but that honestly seems pretty difficult for me, at least from what I saw. On top of that, there is another notable difference. In normal Minesweeper, the mines are randomly placed around the board. However, in this mode, the artifacts and obstructions are placed in clusters that are shown on the bottom of the screen. It is through recognizing the shape of the clusters that one can deduce if it is an artifact or an obstruction, but they can also use this as part of the strategy to try and figure out whether or not there are bombs at certain locations or not. Finally, another major difference is that you will have to use those patterns on the bottom to figure out if it's an artifact or if it's an obstruction. And if it's an artifact, you will have to use the Excavate tool, which is just clicking on the little icon and then clicking on all of the parts of the shape to be able to receive points for extracting it. If you're someone who enjoys Minesweeper, you will probably enjoy this as well. I do like Minesweeper, so I enjoy this. Though it does suffer from being noticeably easier than normal Minesweeper um, for a couple of reasons. The clusters is one, and the other one is that uh, mines cannot spawn in the initial tiles around a cluster. So if you recognize a cluster, you can rapidly clear large parts of the board. However, the gameplay of a strange Minesweeper mod really isn't the main point of this mod. Its main focus is just showing how far we can go from Reforger with the Infusion Engine and mod making in general. If a mod can be made that transforms the tactical military shooter into an adorable little Minesweeper clone, then one can only imagine what else is possible. And this is why the devs put so much emphasis on this mod in their dev like blogs over the last couple of weeks. And it's really, they want to uh, show off what the engine and, and modding is able to do, likely in a hope from them to invigorate the modding community to make something a little bit more interesting than a quirky little Minesweeper clone that they made. But those are just my thoughts. This has been Christopher Beast, and I hope to see you all next time.